Alright, so today I'm going to do a review um, on the mattress. This box is nasty, dirty. It's a 45 piece titanium nitride tap and die set metric I got from Harbor Freight. Um, like I stated in the last video, this one is the box looks identical to the standard. Um, the hinges are nice and tight. Only issue I found is that um, they tend to fall out. You know, but things happen. There. And it actually states on it M12 by 1.5. So, you know, they're easy to read. M8. 1.0 so that's you know it's it's a nice feature that they're easy to read it does get kind of annoying every once in a while um, this set I use a lot of the m16 by 1.5 it's still holding up I use the M18 by 1.5 a lot. The titanium seems to be holding up pretty well, especially for the price. You know, a 45 piece set, you know, from other companies, even Craftsman, their 45 piece set I think is like 200 something dollars. So for 80 bucks, it's n not a bad deal. I haven't any problem with the taps or the dies on this set. Other than the dies falling out of their perspective spots in the box. You know, that's the only problem I've had. Um, but it, it holds up well. It's nice and sturdy. It opens pretty easily. Um, it's the handles are nice. I I particularly like these because they're nice and heavy. Uh, it goes through M6 to M25, quarter inch or one inch. You can use these for the standard. So if you have you know both kits and you forget the standard handle in the house, you can always just use this one and just go get the standard. Um, taps. Um, the dies are the die holder is also nice. It's got three large screws. The handles are nice and sturdy. It it works really well. I'm pretty positive the handles are made of steel, and the the die holder is actually made in um, aluminum. Same with the tap holder. All in all, it's a good set. Um, Brad's workbench, I you know, had a conversation with him a while back about these sets. He wanted to pick up a couple of these, one of each of these sets, I think is what he stated, but he wasn't sure if they were worth it. In all honesty, Brad, I honestly do believe they are worth the $80, especially when you, it's, it's hard to find tap and die sets that are, are an arm and a leg to buy, especially even something as low as like a 20 or 30 piece set from Craftsman is over a hundred bucks. So, you know, 45 pieces isn't too bad. Um, this is for the smaller bits like these. Uh, so the price isn't, isn't too shabby. And I honestly think it was worth every penny. They do a great job. They fell out again. That's the only problem I have with this set. They do not stay. For whatever reason. But you know, that could be just my box is defective. That could be the problem.
Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next video. Please rate, comment, and subscribe.